Today is not a special day. Never thought I'd say that, um, ever, regarding football or FIFA, but here we are. We have just lost 7-2 to Aston Villa. I remember the day where I was when we lost 6-1 versus Stoke. I was there in Kiev when we lost, obviously with Kairos mistakes in the, the Champions League final. And we've just lost 7-2 to Aston Villa with one of the worst defensive performances I've ever seen and probably one of the worst goalkeeping performances since I attempted to play in goal in a Sunday league game and conceded six. Yeah, we still won that game. But I can't believe we've just conceded seven goals, guys. Um, I thought the Man United performance was, you know... Incredible and shocking. Then we go one more and lose by one more goal than them. Um, what the hell is football right now? Like, honestly, what is going on? The only positive thing about today's performance is that we're still somehow fifth after losing 7-2. Probably the worst thing about losing 7-2 is having an international break after it. I can't believe how shocking Bobby Firmino was today. I thought he was really dreadful. Just making too many mistakes. I thought Joe Gomez was as probably bad as um, Firmino. I thought Adrian was that bad. He might not play for us again. So much so that we might even have a different keeper in goal than him next week. Well, two weeks time. I can't believe that performance. Salah got, you know, two goals, but a 2-1, well, sorry, 1-0 down, I was like, yeah, okay, you know, we go down by one goal a lot, right? Maybe something different can happen, but it never did. We just kept conceding. Ross Barkley played out of his mind. Jack Grealish looked world class. We literally made John McGinn look like a prime Paul Scholes. And to be fair to John McGinn, he's a good player. But he's not a Scholes, is he? What is going on with this season? Everton are top of the league. Aston Villa are, I believe, second. Um, the football, the sport of football has gone mad. Leicester, a third. We're on level points with Villa. Because they've played one game less, but... Oh my God. Man City are 14th after three games. Chelsea have spent a fortune in seventh. Man United 16th after three games play. <sighs> you know when you just can't explain something regarding why football's gone crazy? I'm in that kind of mindset right now. The only good thing about this possibly being a special day, guys, is that I've grinded on... The road to glory, zero to hero, and we are hopefully about to lock in either top 100 rewards or top 200 rewards. That's, that's a good thing about today, right? Right? Seven goals, man. The positioning of Adrian when Villa nearly got a goal as well, you might have seen the clip, guys, was, I just don't get it. It almost screams a bit of arrogance. It's just weird. I, I don't understand it. Um, no player, in my opinion, was good today. Except maybe Salah's finishing, but that's it. Um, obviously, missing Mane was huge, and we're always going to struggle. And obviously, Allison, man, it shows how great Allison is, doesn't it? It'd probably be what at least maybe two or three goals less with Allison in. I don't know, but it felt like we had a player sent off for the entire game. That's what it was like. In terms of match ratings, I want you guys to comment down below with your match ratings and be brutally honest. What what is your thoughts on this game? I didn't expect to be doing a double upload today, but you know what? I think I've got to do a match reaction for this kind of shocking scoreline. Um, seven goals to Aston Villa. Holy crap, man. Like, to not even come back when we were 2-1-0 one, one down, I just thought, I had that feeling like, oh yeah, we'll come back, we'll hopefully win. Seven goals. Thank God it wasn't A2 for all the memes. Jesus. Oh, my God. 
Unbelievable. Um, ridiculous. The amount of memes that will be now happening thanks to this scoreline as well is uh, is insane. I think, as all Liverpool fans were, we all enjoyed the United loss. Now we paid for it by losing 7-2 to Aston Villa. I'm going to go to Mackey's and get a large Big Mac meal and nine chicken nuggets and a large Coke Zero and then probably, I don't know, probably somehow watch that match back. Unreal. Hopefully, guys, have a special day. We're back again for the grind tomorrow on the road to glory. I'm loving that. I can't believe we just lost 7-2 to Aston Villa. That really just happened.